My name is Tamara Garcia. I'm an RHI 2T student at Baker College. And this is my video on professionalism in the workplace. Professionalism is defined as one's conduct at work. In spite of the word's root, this quality is not restricted to those in occupations we describe as professionals. Typically those that require a high level of education and have high degrees. Cashiers, janitors, and waitresses can demonstrate a high level of professionalism just as doctors, lawyers, or engineers can display a low level of it, or vice versa. What are some of the words you think of when you think of professionalism? Let's write them down. Trustworthy is the first one that comes to mind. Competent, another strong one. Considerate. Integrity, courteous, cooperative, empathetic, dependable, Committed, approachable, accountable, and respectful. Let's look at some of these words a little further. Take respectful, for example. This includes self-respect, respect for others, and staying out of others' affairs. If we look at accountable, we can look at accepting personal responsibility, respect for the experience, and watching inappropriate language. In the United How is professionalism judged? Against it's judged against one's stand, expectations or standards. It's judged against one's personal values and understanding of what professionalism really is. It's situational in nature. It's judged by your communication and your competence. It's judged by your image, judged by your demeanor. And one thing we frequently don't think of, it's strongly influenced by culture. Bernard Baruch, an American statesman, said it best. He said, we didn't all come over on the same ship, but we're all in the same boat. For instance, in the United States, kissing a business associate is not considered appropriate. But in Paris, a peck on the cheek is an acceptable greeting. A firm handshake is considered appropriate in the United States. But in some Asian countries, it's considered rude. In fact, in Germany, it's considered offensive to shake hands with your other hand in your pocket. We must all cultivate and understand tolerance. Some of the unwritten rules that we have we talked about are attitudes, approaches, how you handle conflict, your values, and your communication styles. What is professionalism? It's a specific style of behavior in the workplace. And this is my video. Thank you very much.